Hi everyone! So it was really fun to share with you guys my previous shop update and I thought that I would share my newest shop update with you guys. So for those of you that don't know, I sell handmade things on Etsy. So yeah, let's just get right into it, jump into it. These are my earrings, by the way. First time making earrings like this. I I'm obsessed, okay? I'm obsessed. <laughs> so first I have my little Snell set. So they're strawberry snails. Here's the like base of the earring. Here's what they look like on the back. I love these little dudes. They're just adorable. <laughs> See, look at his little face. <laughs> this is my favorite pair that I've made. These are Luna Moths and they're made out of this Fimo clay that has this gemstone effect. I'm obsessed with these. They're stunning in my opinion. I'm gonna make myself a pair to wear because I'm I'm just in love with them. I could stare at them all day, I think. <laughs> Mushroom earrings with some moss on the bottom or grass, whatever you wanna call it. Here's what the top looks like. So there they are. I really love these two, I think they're adorable. Here is a pair of cow earrings, strawberry cows, and they have these cute little beads dangling from the strawberry. I, I love these two, so cute. Okay, I have two pairs of these. They are Kirby's holding little knives. Can can you see? Can you see that? <laughs> Look at him. I'm I love these so much. Whenever I sketched out the design for this, I was like, this is gonna turn out good. And I was right. It did turn out good. <laughs> Those moments whenever you want to be cute but a little dangerous. <laughs> I made some Tamagotchi characters, so here's this little strawberry dude. I can't remember their names off the top of my head, I do apologize, but I do have two pairs of these and I think they're just so cute. I did this for myself, it's not for sale, but it's to hold like pins and paintbrushes and stuff if you want one. I can, I can make some for my shop, just let me know. But I turned him into earrings because I just thought he was so adorable that I just had to. And there are two pairs of those. Look how chubby he is. <laughs> because my Ditto Pop Socket did so well, I decided, you know what? While I'm waiting for Pop Sockets to get in the mail, to arrive in the mail, you know what I mean? I made a pair of Ditto earrings. Freaking adorable. <laughs> Here's a pair of cloud earrings. Very fairy core. Very cute. <laughs> Here's a set of little Tamagotchi earrings. Adorable together. Continuing on with that kind of 90s vibe, I made little Furbies and I made them little mix match because I just thought it would be cuter than making them match. I don't know, the thought process in my brain whenever I was making these, I was just like, two different dudes. Two different dudes, two different styles, they're boyfriends. <laughs> I made these strawberry earrings, I actually have a pair of these for myself because I love them so much. And then I have these two little fossils from Animal Crossing Nintendo Switch Joy-Con controllers. I just thought that these would be fun to make. They're adorable in my opinion. And little pitfall seeds from my Animal Crossing girlies because we love it. <laughs> so there are my earrings that I made. They're kind of in a, in a pile now. Let's move on to other stuff because I have a ton of stuff to show you guys. <laughs> I have some acrylic pieces. So I have this little Michael Myers pin. These little paper clips. So this little gyroid, gyroid, how do you say it? From Animal Crossing. A uh, little Tamagotchi and Gengar from Pokemon. A Cooking Mama pin. Like a little cartridge for the DS. And this little stand of the Pink Palace from Coraline. I love it. I think it's stunning. <laughs> So just a quick overview of the new little um, acrylic pins that I have, or acrylic creations, they're not all pins. Here are some of my pop sockets. So I have an egg pop socket, <laughs> or phone grip, sorry you can't say pop socket, you'll get in trouble. Phone grip. <laughs> this little Kirby on a heart, very sparkly. This little just plain Kirby, like sweater texture pop socket, it's a heart. And then I have a pink one. And these two come with a matching foam charm. I just think it looks so cozy in my opinion. Of course it would be my opinion because I thought, you know what? Words are difficult. We've established that by now. 
in honor of Melanie Martinez releasing her new CD, I thought, you know what? I need, I need to make something. So I made this necklace and let's see here if I can get the strap out of the way. So I made her little like fairy self, some mushrooms going on, gems, little freckles, all sorts of stuff. She also has some moss growing around her. I just thought that it was really fun. I also put these like little diamonds hanging down. Some mushrooms on the side. They've got little butterflies on them. And of course I had to go with this kind of pearl, dark metally pearl diamond uh, bead mixture. I just thought that it fit everything so well. This was not very easy to make so I only made one. I love. <laughs> Of course, I have some clay charms going on. I made Toxia, please. I had to. Um, so she's a little chibi, and she's got this like little mushroom hat, this little pink raincoat, a big flower purse, just looking adorable. And she's on the scrunchie, in case you like want to take her off the scrunchie, it's also a keychain. So there's, there she is. <laughs> I made a tiny little Snorlax. Hello airplane. I also made this little frog, which is probably my favorite thing that I've made. This is fern. <laughs> She's also got this like little, or really big <laughs> flower purse with the mushroom hat. It's just, I think she's adorable. I wanna keep her, but I wanna sell her at the same time, so. Somebody give her a good home because she's really cute. I made one of these snails, strawberry snails as a keychain because the strawberry snail itself is adorable. These right here are like little Nintendo Switches. Not Switches, Nintendo DS's. So I made them like really sparkly, fairy-like, cutesy. So two DS's, two Nintendo 2DS's. These two are the pins. This one's just a charm. Far than a mushroom dust plug. I love dust plugs so much. This little Kirby keychain. He's like got that gemstone clay going on. That's what that set looks like. And then I have a little stitch stitches from Animal Crossing. I made another one of these. He has a little keychain too. He was really fun to make. I like it. I made two more of these little Pokemon charms. Another one of my favorites, which is Jigglypuff. Like, she's also on a charm. Like, she just looks so cute with this clay. An Animal Crossing villager from, well, Animal Crossing. <laughs> so there are the charms that I made. Now let's go on to some other stuff. As we all know, Easter is really soon. So I made these little bunny brooches. They have little bunny tails, these carrots, little Easter egg, and they're little brooches. So that's what the brooch part looks like. So I have three pink ones, two blue ones. Here's what the pink one looks like up close. And the brooch part. I have a ton of these like beaded phone straps and they also work for Tamagotchis as well. So it just straps in like that. And I will also show you the one that is on my 2DS because I use it for that as well. Here's the one on my 2DS. It just makes everything a lot easier whenever you just strap that on your wrist. It's like a wrist strap if I didn't say that before. So yeah, I have like all of these. Some pearl ones, different colors. This one is my favorite. <laughs> Last but not least, I have this Kuromi Nintendo Switch game uh, game holder. So there's what it looks like. It's super sparkly, covered in UV resin for protection, and you have this little space for a charm. So it's like a little keychain. So it holds 11 games and two SD cards. So that is my newest case. So yeah, those are the things that I made for March so far. And I will put my Etsy shop link down below. That way you can go check it out. And yeah, it would really mean a lot to me even if you just went and looked around. So yeah, that is it for this video. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I adore you all so much. Bye. Smooch. <laughs>